and it doesn't matter the ball, whether it's Pro-Am or Stadium. 98 Pro-Am, John. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're taking a little field trip over to the Proton Warehouse to pick up uh, a couple bats. Luckily, it's not too far. It's only like 15 minutes away. But uh, yeah, see you there. All right, here we go. We made it over to Proton here in Arizona. So, uh... Yeah, let's do this. John, welcome to Proton. How's it going? How's it Good going? Good to see you. Good to see you. Hi. Got Ashley over here. Yep, here we do all of our shipping. We have all of our hats, all of our apparel. Everything gets moved out of uh, this location here after the bats are assembled and prepared. And uh, she is here most of her life. <laughs> We're getting very hard. Good right rest. on. Very cool. Yeah, so now we come back here. This is our uh, shop. This is where we do our assembly. Lex Ramirez assembles every single bat that's uh, made. <laughs> very and, nice. Uh, over here is where we do some of our testing and final prep. We have a little hitting area where we hit our bats and compression test them every you know, 50 swings check exit velocity. We also test our competitors' bats as well in here, and um, very pleased with what we have so far on our uh, performance and durability. Lex, you want to take some swings? Sure. Nice, let's do this. All right, so this is the Series 2 Proton. I don't know how many hits we have on this one, but we'll go ahead and compression test it real quick. So we're at 275. Thank you, Lex. Give it another test, one third of the way around the bat here. So we're right at just under 275 here. I imagine that this bat probably then has a couple hundred swings on it, 150 swings. We've been hitting right. this one for a little bit here. We then tested against competitors' bats at similar compression. And what we found is we're getting anywhere from one to three miles, in some cases, four miles an hour more than our competitors' bats at the same compression. What's also nice is you can go ask any guy on our team, even some of our biggest hitters have two to 3,000 swings on their bats and they're still passing. So we'll do some exit velo testing here right now on the new Series 2 at 275. It's crazy. Lex. I wish I could show some of the data that we get from the others, even some of the bats that are considered 95 Lex. It's considered to be some of the best bats on the market. We are outperforming them, and I can't wait for everyone to figure that out for themselves. 92. 89. So we do a lot of the in between making bats. We didn't have much time to do this over the past couple of weeks. It's been 10 to 12 hours a day, Saturday and Sunday, getting caught up on orders, getting uh, bats ready for shipment. But in between, we'll come out here, we'll take, you know, 100 hits on the bats at a time, and just constantly testing, make sure that there's any areas we can improve. We also have a couple different handle flexes as well. And for anyone that is wondering, oh, I can't do a one piece, I really encourage them to try it. And John, you're going to be reviewing one of these yourself. It's really hard to tell the difference between our our bat and a uh, and a two piece with some of the new uh, technology we have in the handle flex. Can't we? Eighty-seven. I think we've worn Lex out. Went out great. So we have our senior down here as well that we've been testing. That's our new senior bat. Very we nice. Have, uh, another one here. Very proud of the of the design and the look. John, you helped us with this, um, putting together the final design. But they're just absolutely beautiful. That color, I can't get another that color. Uh, also, with our senior bat, seniors are going to be very pleased with what we've done with those as well. We're getting thousands of swings by some bigger senior hitters, holding compression for a very long time, 
and, uh, and also performing very well. The sound is a key differentiator between us and our competitors. You'll notice there's a big difference in the sound and the, the feel. So, John, very do you want to take some swings? Yeah, let's do this. All right. 95. Pretty good, I missed it that one. Still 94. 95. Oh, this is 98. Really? That's what it says here. John's gonna be hitting our bat against some competitors' bats and some upcoming videos as well. 98 again, John. And I can't wait for you guys to see the data. I personally can't show it for obvious reasons, but we're very pleased. You guys will see we are getting better exit velocity. 97, John, we're getting better exit velocity than our competitors at the same compression. And that data is impossible to, uh, to argue. Uh, then on top of that, guys, we're getting thousands, thousands of hits out of our bats while still passing compression. And uh, that's something that is completely different than what we see So bringing value to the players is, is big for us here as we uh, try to show everyone out there that we've made a bat. This is a lot better than everyone else's. We're very proud of it. Not a couple. 98 again. Now we are using a stadium ball here because that helps us really track our durability. You know, the Pro-Am is a softer core ball. We can put a uh, pro -Am up there to show you uh, the exit velocity on that as well. John, you want to throw a pro -Am up there? Sure. We hit hard balls. We do hit stadiums here because that helps us with durability, right? If we're getting uh, over a thousand swings on stadiums, we know we have something great on the pro -Ams. And it doesn't matter the ball, whether it's pro -Am or stadium. Better. 98 with the pro hand, John. <laughs> we're, we're getting. And it's what, about 90 degrees in here? Yeah, it's hot <laughs> as hell in here. Yes, it is. Um, we always have sweat coming off. 97. So you see Pro Am Stadium. The bat's made to hit the Pro Am. Um, but we do notice that uh, uh, they are a lot easier on the bats than the stadiums. John, thanks for trying them out. Feels good. I like it. All right. Well, thanks, guys, for having me out. It was a dream come true. So, guy, <laughs> parting words. Uh, John, thanks for coming in. Really appreciate it. Thanks for swinging the bat. Look forward to the review that you do. Hey, everyone, we had a rocky first year. There was a lot of things that didn't work out good, but I promise you, this is one of the best bats out there. We're very proud of what we have. We know it's lasting. You can reach out to Ashley or Lex, who are working 10, 12 hours a day every day to keep up on orders. If you order a bat today, it will ship today. If you order a bat after five, it will ship tomorrow. We're very proud of it. It is lasting. Reach out to any one of our team or any of our customers that bought it. We're really proud of it and uh, hope you guys get a chance to check it out as well. So, thanks. All right. All right, well, there we have it, everybody. That was so much fun. Probably one of the easily top three, top five, uh, top three experiences I've, I've ever had uh, associated with softball. Again, Huge thanks to Charles and his team for their generosity with their time to let me come out there, take some hacks, hang out with the crew. Uh, I cannot wait. They sent me home with one of the new U-Trip and one of the new senior bats, and I cannot wait to get those on the field and get some hits on them to show you guys exactly what they can do. But hey, until next time, remember, hashtag SwingProton. See ya.